What's up everyone and welcome to the club. In today's video we're drawing Bubba Bubba Fant from Poppy Playtime. Let's begin today's lesson in the center of the page and draw two large ovals for the eyes. We're gonna start with the one on the left. We're gonna start from the very top. It's gonna work our way around toward the bottom and then bend that back up towards the top. Now you wanna leave a small gap in between the eyes and draw the same size oval on the right. So let's line up the top. I'm gonna bring that down towards the same height and then bend that back up towards the top. Let's draw two smaller ovals pushed towards the inside of each eye. So we're going to start on the left, going all the way around, and then up, and do the same thing on the right, going all the way around. Now I'm going to switch to a thick black marker and fill the outside of each eye. So going around the pupils. Now I want to place the trunk in between the eyes. We're going to start with a curve. On the left side, we're going to go up and then down. Let's go back over towards the left side. We're going to curve the trunk, going around and in, and then come down. Let's curl the tip of the trunk. So we're going to go all the way around and go up on the right. Now let's curl that back, going up and then in. Let's go over towards the right side, and curve the trunk going out, and just tuck that in along the top. And then on the end, we draw a circle. Now I want to layer the mouth in behind the trunk. Let's start from the side, just underneath the eyes, then just out, and then up. Let's add a fold, stepping in, going around, and then down. Let's draw the bottom of the mouth. Starting back on the left, curve this around, pull that in behind the trunk, continue on the right, going across and then up underneath that fold. Let's place the tongue on the bottom left. We start with a curve going up and then down. Step back, curve the top going in behind the trunk. Let's go back to our thick black marker and fill the inside of the mouth. Let's draw the lower half of the head going around the mouth. We're going to start on the left side, go around the cheek. It's going to trace the mouth coming around, underneath the trunk, go up on the right side. We're just going to bend that in. Now on top of the left cheek, let's curve the inside of the ear. We're going to go up and then in. Now we're going to draw the trim, going up, go all the way around, and then in towards the side. Bend this down toward the bottom and pull that up towards the side of the head. Now I want to leave a gap for the ear and draw the top of the head. So we're going to go up, bend this down in the middle, go above the right eye, and then down, curve around the side of the head, and then pull that in on top of the cheek. Let's draw the inside of the ear flipped over on the right. So we're going to start on the side of the head, going up, come around, and then in. Bend this down, round out the ear, and pull that up. Let's go back over towards the left side. We're going to trace the outside of the ear. We'll go up. I'm just going to follow that curve, coming in, down, and then in. Let's do the same thing on the right. Let's layer the eyebrows on top of the head. We're going to start on top of the brow. We're going to go up and then bend that down. Now that we complete the head, let's move down and draw that light bulb pendant. We're going to start underneath the chin, bend the left side. We're going to go out and in. Go back up to the top, go around the opposite side and in. Let's go back over towards the left, come around towards the bottom, and then up on the right. 
And then along the bottom, we're gonna add two curves. Starting on the left, go across and up, step up and do that again. In the middle, going up and then down, go up and then back down towards the bottom. Now over on the left side, we're gonna draw in the arm. Let's start underneath the head, start with the shoulder, rounding this out, going out, then the arm coming up and then in towards the hand, round out the edge of the hand coming down towards the bottom. Let's go back up to the top, going around the outside of the arm, come down towards the elbow and bend that out, round out the arm and then pull that in towards the bottom. Now I'm gonna add a seam going across and then down. Now on the right side of that light bulb, we're gonna draw the body. Curve this out, round out the belly, and then pull that in. Let's separate the back in between the arm, coming down. Now from the light bulb, draw a straight angle line going up towards the shoulder. Let's go back down to the bottom, draw the left leg. I'm gonna bend this around and down. Round out the bottom of the leg, pull that up on the right. Now we'll continue that curve going up underneath the arm. Let's separate the bottom of the leg with a curve. Now let's layer the right leg in behind. We're gonna start underneath the belly, bend this down and out. Round up the bottom of the leg, come in. I'm just gonna bend that up underneath the body. We're gonna separate the bottom of the leg with another curve. Now you're gonna tuck the right arm in behind the body. So let's start from the top, bend this around and then up. Round up the top of the hand, come down along the outside, and then back in towards the body. Let's draw an oval along the top of the arm. And then we'll step down and add a trim, coming down and then up. Let's move over and draw on the tail. We're gonna start from the top of the leg, bend this down and then up. And then from here, bend this in and then up. And we'll add some fur on the end down, go up and out. Let's work our way around the left side, coming down, going up, just gonna round out the bottom and then pull that back in. Now I wanna trace the bottom of the tail and then we'll sign our art and add a splash of color. And that's pretty much it. That's how we draw Bubba Bubba Fan from Poppy Playtime. I hope you enjoyed today's lesson. If you did, please make sure you subscribe because I'm posting new lessons every single day. You can also check out our other channels. I'll leave the links for you in the description below. I wanna thank you for watching and I'll see you again soon.